this fraudulent business has been going on for five years undetected. And this is one small element of the waste management business because we're referring to toxic waters. Okay? So my question to the Honourable Minister is, I would like to know whether an inquiry to find out if there are other areas where fraudulent activities could have occurred in his ministry. First of all, I would like to point out that it is my ministry which uncovered the suspected fraudulent practices. So far from the only member to come and give me lessons now. No from the person sitting by his side. Secondly, covered by whom? Covered by whom? By me? Shakil Mohamed. You know, I don't uh, represent... Shakil Mohamed, I represent. have several times asked you not to make comments from a sitting position. This is most irregular. Please. Yes. Madam Speaker, I would also request that he withdraws what he said. He cannot say that I covered up anything. Honorable Shakil Mohamed. I'm not withdrawing please, anything. Please, please. <clears throat> I heard you saying, in yes. fact, I heard you saying cover up. Yes. So, did you mean to say that the minister has been covering up this, what you call massive fraud? I said the ministry is covering it up, and I'm not withdrawing it. Did this you say that the, the ministry, ministry is covering, covering it up, it, and, and I'm not... Can, and you can substantiate that the ministry of course I can. is covering of course it. Of course I can. Okay, so you, you'll substantiate it when we come to light with it. And I'm speaker... When he used the word cover, I looked at him straight in the eye and said, by whom? And he said, you. Yes. So I read, I, I ask that he withdraws it. If he said you, I, I demand that he withdraws it. So I, will, I don't think we will lose precious time to go on this. I'll come back on this after I have checked what has happened. Please proceed. Incidentally, Incidentally, all those people who are making the disruptive provocations. Well, my father did not act for uh, traffickers in arms dealing. Let him know that. Oh, Honourable Minister, I am sorry. I am really sorry that whatever you have said has nothing to do with the reply. This has nothing to do with your reply. Because I believe that this... This is acrimonious exchanges between members, and you can do this outside, not here, right? This has nothing to do, and I think, Honorable Minister, that you should withdraw what you said, so that we clear with this. Please withdraw what you just said. No. This has nothing to do with the Every government. single aspect relating to this case has been brought... I don't want to hear any explanation. This is precious question time, right? Just withdraw what you said, we will settle the matter. I will check whatever has been said by the honorable member also, and I'll come back with a ruling. But at this point in time, I'll request you to withdraw what you just said. Madam, what am I supposed to withdraw, please? I don't know. No, look, honorable minister, don't argue with me. Don't argue with me. I have asked you. I have asked you to withdraw what you just said. This is my ruling. Right? So I think you should. Honorable, Honorable Minister, I'm addressing myself to you. And I don't think that it is ethical when I am addressing myself to you that you address yourself to honorable members. I've asked you to withdraw what you just said, and I think you should withdraw what you just said. Madam, may I say, Madam, I'm prepared to withdraw. What I have said was part of a PNQ and he replied. Unreservedly, withdraw what you just said. Honorable Minister, I'm not going to argue with you. This is the last time I'm giving my ruling. I've asked you to withdraw, so you withdraw it unreservedly. I withdraw, Madam, as per respect to you. Okay, then proceed with your reply now. Now, Madam, all the necessary documents which relate to that case, which have been uncovered by my ministry, have been remitted to the police authorities. However, I don't know which document the gentleman from the other side is referring to. Before I can give a reply about it, I would need to consult it. 
Okay.